when you have a YouTube channel and you do a few reviews and the reviews go reasonably well, you get lots of views on them, you get inundated by companies offering you products to review. I must get three or four a day of all sorts of weird and wonderful stuff. And there's various ways they ask you to do it. They'll ask you to review a product and they'll pay you. And I don't want paying for reviewing a product. They'll ask you to say various things. I don't agree with that. And they ask you to send a preview video to be approved by them before it goes live. And I don't agree with that. And I choose products that I actually will use or want to use as part of the process. And I always try to get a second one so I can give it away to one of my viewers and one of my subscribers. And these are the two products we've had sent through so far. And I'm really pleased with them, they work really well. But if you, I've never heard of Soundcore, look at Anchor. The Anchor business, the things they make, are really, really good quality. And these reflect it as well. They've been well thought out. And as it says on the box, over 20 million people have used them. Louis, thank you. I'm useless not playing the guitar, but I've discovered I can play it through this. So let's have a look at this and um, it links to one of the wireless microphones that I recently reviewed. And I was just wondering, you can play this music through this, through Bluetooth, and there's a wire input as well, so you can plug the receiver of the microphone in and play it through this. But let's have a deeper look at all the functions on that one and this smaller one so what we got we've got the motion boom which is the smaller one and the motion boom plus and these are bluetooth speakers but the thing that i was really interested in about these even um as well as being from anchor as they do some amazing bits of kit to anchor is that these are 100 percent waterproof and the float as well and uh, if you haven't seen any of my sailing videos, I go sailing every so often, two or three times a year. And I thought that would be brilliant to have on the yacht. So if it goes over the side, it'll float and we should be able to go around and pick it up. So if somebody doesn't like the music, we can throw it overboard and we can still recover it. So we thought we'd have a look at both of these. And I'm going to give one of these away later on in the video, so stay tuned. But let's have a look at the functions we're getting both of these. A lot of information on the back. This is the smaller one. So the powerful sound, customise equaliser, so there's an app for an equaliser so you can uh, alter some of these sound qualities to suit you best. Um, there's an output on it so you can use it to charge your phone and other devices. Titanium speakers, playtime 24 hours, so once it's tra um, charged up you should be able to run it for 24 hours. The sound app, which we've talked about, 40 kilohertz, waterproof and dustproof base and uh, as a USB-C connector for charging it as well and this is the bigger one so more powerful still got the equalizer this has got an input so you can uh, put an auxiliary lead into that and that's what I did with the microphone to play the guitar for it which was quite good playtime slightly shorter 20 hours but uh, it's going to be a decent party if you're partying for 24 hours. Um, titanium speakers again, 40 hertz, waterproof and dustproof. You get a carrying handle with it and it also comes with a USB connector. And I believe this bigger one as well, you can connect to other speakers. So if other people have these same sort of speakers, you can connect up to about 100 of these together. Don't know why you would, it'd be some significant advent and undoubtedly somebody on YouTube's already done it. What's in the box? I have played with these for a bit, but the thing I like about them is they're nice and simple. There's a quick start book, and then there's one with a lot more information in. But um, it's almost self-explanatory, this. You get a lead to charge it from USB. So that's in there, and that's it. And then you get the main unit. This is the smaller one of the two. So there's a bass boost, there's the Bluetooth link, the volume up and down, the on and off button, and this TWS is to link it to another unit. And when you switch it on... Ooh, 
comes to life and plays you a little tune. <laughs> there we are. The Bluetooth's linked to my phone already. The bass is on or off. And then you can switch it off again. And when you switch it off, sorry, you have to press and hold it. Plays you a little tune to say it's going off as well. On the back of this, and to meet the waterproof side, there are the two USBs. There's an input and an output. So the output is obviously to charge your phone and the input is to charge the rechargeable battery in this and it has this big rubber plug that you need to make sure is safe in there to keep the dust and the water out. As these base units on the side both on the same side and then the speakers in there and those speakers are supposed to be titanium as well so they won't rust and they should be super lightweight and strong. Actually playing the music from one of my last videos, the moon over there. so I don't copy, get a copyright strike. And the volume and the quality of the playback is very good. Put the bass on. That really deepens it. Sound quality is very good, very good. It's very impressive for its size. You can see these moving for the base. Where they've just released a new set of jackets. To go with their new hat. That's enough of listening to me. This is the Soundcore app. It's easy to find. So I'm just downloading the app. And this is for the equaliser for the unit. I've just uploaded the app, which as you can see, I've got 4G but very little signal. So it's just asking me to do a firmware update. So the app was very easy to set up. And once you're in the app, you can start and stop the play. I'm just playing some music from Epic Sounds, which is copyright free. It's a subscription which we use for YouTube. Turn the volume up. There's some presets for the equalizer. Or you can start your own custom and save those. It's quite comprehensive really. So the sound from that is quite loud. For the size of it, that's very impressive. It'd be too loud to have it on full in the camper van. And there's, there's no distortion as well. And the app is very easy to use. So generally speaking, easy, straightforward, no messing about, no not lots of parts. Even if you lost this lead, you could just find another lead to charge it up. Waterproof, dustproof. Apps easy to download and the functions on here are really simple <clears throat> So well impressed Let's have a look at the bigger one Now this is the bigger one. This is the plus and you can see it's got tweeters and a handle on this one as well and I think it's got a couple more functions But again, I've had a look at this. I've had a play with this 
same two straightforward real easy instruction book and you can basically work out how to use this without the instruction book which is what I really like well, with the things with these people make them really complicated but Anchor the organization the business that make these are a really good organization as I say some of the products I've looked at in the past for them have been excellent comes with a strap so a shoulder strap like a ghetto blaster same packaging and you get the one lead as well for charging it put that down there out of the way so it looks very similar to the other one but this one's got tweeters in it's the same construction with the base booms in the side there the two speakers they're titanium again and they're titanium Similar sort of functions on the top here, but this one, instead of just being able to connect to one other speaker, this one can be connected to many, I think up to 100 speakers. And then you've got your Bluetooth, your bass, your on and off, and your volume control. And then this strap, which is a very good quality strap, and metal connections on it, clips onto there. So you can use it as a shoulder strap to carry it around. Or you could use it to strap it to something on a boat if the boat is bouncing around. Again, 100% waterproof. Make sure that that covers on, because if that's left open and it goes over side, it's not going to be waterproof. The main difference with this one as well, is you've got the two sockets same as the other one, but you've got the small mini jack there as well. And we'll have a look at that again in a minute. So that fits in there to keep the dust and the water out. And the functions are very similar. The app is the same app and all the gadgets and equalizers and everything else on the phone app works the same onto this as well. I'm thinking of what I could plug into the actual socket on the back, that mini jack socket. <coughs> and if you've uh, seen this review I've done of this Hollyland uh, speaker system, I use this on one of my action cameras, but use it a lot on my iPhone as well and um, it's got a remote device here and two speakers and there's fluffy must for those as well so you can use it out the side when it's windy and this keeps it charged up but I when I was looking at this I thought what could I plug into it and then I thought I wonder if I can actually use this and one of the leads that comes with it so this just plugs into the side and into here into that mini jack which you'd be able to use with this microphone and okay you can talk for it but what use is that but this will clip onto a guitar and you can play guitar through it so the microphone's plugged in the back and if I bring the microphone you can hear but there's no feedback no feedback from it which is quite impressive and then you can clip this onto the guitar like so he says trying to do it one-handed and then you can use it like a pickup it's about as good as my guitar playing gets idea so as well as being able to use this bigger one in the same way as you can use the smaller one having that little jack on the black back you could plug it into other devices maybe not a wireless microphone like this but you might want to plug it into a PA system a karaoke system um, into your TV TV in your camper van or um, any devices on a yacht that uses that micro jack stereo um, plug well, I said I'd do a giveaway on these and I'm not particularly bothered which one I keep so this giveaway is going to be slightly different so this is the small one and that's obviously the bigger one and we've looked through the differences so if you've done a giveaway entered into a giveaway on my channel before it's the same sort of process you need to be a subscriber you need to leave in the comments of this video and only this video I want one but you also need to say small or big because if I choose you randomly as the winner, I need to know if you want this smaller one or if you want the bigger one. And whichever one you decide, the, one, the random person that will choose from that will win the relevant actual unit. Unfortunately, I have to pay for the postage to get these out to people. So this is only for people in the UK. 
I'm sorry for all my visitors, uh, my viewers abroad, but it does cost a bit to send these abroad and all the problems with postage at the moment. I'll just keep this to the UK. So just to cover that again, you need to be a subscriber. And if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. It helps me. You need to say, I want one and use those words because I use those words in the comment to choose randomly the winner. And alongside, I want one, you need to say small or big because I won't know which one you want. Uh, it's only for people in the UK, as I say, because I cover the postage for this. Hope you enjoyed the video and it wasn't as boring as these two obviously see it is. And we'll catch you on the next one. The closing date will be below and all the information we have about these and any discount codes or anything else will also be below in the description and I'll pick it in a comment as well. But well impressed with them, well pleased with them, another great piece of kit. You got anything to add you two? Mm. Anything to add? No?